Hi everyone, this is Laura. So today I wanted to do my 11th show and tell. And um, I love that you guys pretty much like this kind of video from me, it seems. So, um, actually, let me just get this in frame really quick right here. There we go. I just um, did that this morning, so I just wanted to show it off. Um, okay, so... Um, on National Scrapbook Day, which was Saturday, I um, spent about four hours um, while my husband was doing a paper. I um, crafted and I had so much fun. And so um, I used my uh, Maggie Holmes papers that I got at Tuesday morning and I also used the Doodlebug stuff. So let me show you guys what I made. Um, first I made this tag right here and um, I just did like some of that fringing here and I did it up here on this piece too but um, it got covered up so um, that's the tag and these are just Tim Holtz um, black tags that I got I believe it Tuesday morning a long time ago so um, yeah I made that tag and then I made this card right here and this was the um, doodle bug little strips of paper, and I just layered them. And uh, this is, what is this die From Pretty Pink Posh. And then this is the um, Unicorn Kitty from Sweet Stamp Shop. And um, this stamp right here is a stamp from, um, you guys, sorry, I'm... <laughs> not thinking all that well right now. It's from the greeting farm. And then I just layered some more papers right there. So that is that one. Um, I did make two Mother's Day cards, but I already took one up to my grandma since I won't be seeing her on Mother's Day, but this is the other one I made. And um, I, so I made this one for my mom and I just think it's so pretty. And you guys, these, um, like this pattern paper right here is a, Project Life card, and then this is a Project Life card from the Maggie Holmes Gather, and then um, this is a flower I made from the Maggie Holmes um, die set, and so yeah, that's how that one turned out, and I put it on this black 110 pound um, cardstock from Michaels, and I just did like some corner rounding, which I hardly ever do. Um, I finished up this uh, flip book and this was something I started uh, last year and I just had like the basic part um, put together and I just went ahead and embellished the whole thing. So um, this is how it looks on the front and then you open it like this and there's that page there and then there is a hello page. And then currently, I just wrote that out because I don't have um, a stamp. And then I just put this little flip card right here. Um, and I put mail tag right there. And um, this is just a little bobby pin, I guess. No, what is that called? I can't remember what that's called. Maybe a bobby pin that I got at Daiso. And I just um, cut out two thick um, pieces of heart cardstock and um, glued it on there so it would be nice and stiff and then it opens here and then that says read me and there this is a little envelope from what is this called um, actually it was a long envelope from Hobby Lobby and I just cut it right here and um, re-glued it and then there's a little note in there and then I just made this little goodie bag right here of some stuff. And then I put that underneath. So that is my flip book. And I'm glad I got that finished because I think that turned out really cute. Oh, and I put a little um, Made With Love sticker here. So um, that was my um, little bit of crafts on National Scrapbooking Day. And also I made some dividers. And... I know a lot of you girls aren't into planners, but 
I kind of am because it kind of gives me like a crafty outlet when I'm out of town. And um, so I made this one right here. And you guys, look how cute that is. So this is um, just a... Um, Oh my gosh, I can't think of what that's called now. Ugh. Anyway, um, I went ahead and just cut the paper to fit, and I laminated it, and I put these cute little uh, enforcers on there to just give it a little bit more. And then this hello right here, I don't mind matching the um, silver with the gold, but um, this hello is from these acetate tags from Target in the dollar spot and I just cut it and um, glued it on to this with um, some, oh my gosh, I can't even think you guys, holy cow, this, this, actually that doesn't even show you what it is. Anyway, you guys know. Um, and then I wanted to show you because um, this right here is from Susan from last month. And then she just made me this one for this month. So look how cute that is. And I think that she makes this um, from the silhouette. So I just think that's adorable. So anyway, that is that one. And then in um, my personal size, um, the ones, the dividers I made on this was um, this one right here and I just used Project Life cards and these Maggie Holmes um, flowers and uh, I made my own top tabs here but um, I went ahead and laminated these inside the dividers this time so there's that one and then there's this one right here and this one which I love this one and then, I'm not sure if I showed you guys this last time or not, but this is um, from Me and My Big Ideas, and it's really, it was really big, like an A5, but I went ahead and cut it down and just put the sticky notes that fit on this side, on this size, so yeah. And then this is the um, last divider I made. So that is the dividers, and then... Um, I am part of the Planner Society um, girls from Christy Tomlinson, and in last month's kit, April's kit, um, we got the sticker book, and um, a lot of girls made like little planner type things with it, and um, like TNs or whatever. I'm not really sure. Um, I guess it's kind of a traveler's notebook, but I left this part on, so I don't know if that still means it's a traveler's notebook. But anyway, this is what I did with mine. And um, I put one of these little sticky pockets on this side. And then I made a little shaker right here for um, the front. And then I have three books in here. So um, this is the first one, and it says My Lists. And then... This was the sticker book part, but I took it all out and I just um, put two of these together to um, just have like this in here. So you can see it's all in here by like the elastics, which I um, watched a YouTube video on that. I punched holes right here and here and then strung the elastic in there, but if you look are kind of crooked but that's okay this is like my first time of ever doing something like this so because I've always been into rings but I just kind of wanted to do something with this because I thought it'd be cute and I'm just leaving this on my desk I don't take it anywhere with me this is my meal planning um, booklet and here's the other side of that of um, this right here and then this is the last one and this just says goals and I put um, this other sticky pocket on it and then this is the back and this is a pin holder that just sticks on and it is from the container store and I know a lot of girls were wanting to see the inside of this and how I put a um, pin holder in here so um, 
that is how that looks and it's pretty tight but it does snap and then I put this um, little charm on here and this is made from Anna so thanks Anna for that um, let's see what else am I gonna show you oh from Target how many minutes oh my gosh I'm already at two minutes okay so I got these things from Target you guys and look how cute this is this little pencil pouch or whatever you want it to be um, it has glitter on this side um, here's some donut sticky notes oops it's stuck to that and um, here are these and I just thought that was really cute um, I found these uh, the sticker book right here and this was three dollars but you get like you get a lot of stickers you get two of each um, sheet here and I like the colors so I thought that was cute and then I wanted to show you guys really quick what Gina sent me Gina scrapanology hi Gina so this is um, I guess a little card type thing she made me and look how cute it is when you open it up and um, there's just like a little note right here and some washi and then she put all kinds of goodies in here look at these cute little unicorns and frames and stickers and um, like this little kitty right here so this was just so so sweet of Gina thank you so much Gina for sending me this and making me this I love these little houses right here I love this house paper I think that is adorable um, there's her YouTube, which all of you guys know who Gina is. And then she sent me this weekly organizer of, um, sticky notes and a memo pad. And look how cute this is there. And then all right there. I mean, how cute. And then there's this little, um, like a little envelope that you can put whatever you want in it's pretty thick so you can hold a lot of stuff in it and then you guys look at this how cute is this dish um I know Bentley loves it and he wanted me to put some treats in it but I didn't so I'm just leaving it here on my desk um I asked her where she got it and she did get it at Hobby Lobby if you girls want to look for it because it is adorable. So Gina, thank you so much for all this. It's so, so cute. And that was so sweet of you. And then my, a friend of mine got me this and I just thought it was so cute. So, I mean, it looks kind of cute together on my desk. So this right here is from Home Goods though. And then, um, the last thing I wanted to show you was this right here. Um, my husband and I had to go to Goodwill to try and find, we were trying to piece together a costume for him and I found this in like the crafty area and it had never been open and it was, or it's 110 yards of this, um, sequins, like, let me see if I can get it. I want to show you guys because I mean, I don't know what I'll ever do with 110 yards, but look at how cute. So, um, $2.99. So, yeah, I think that is all I have to show you guys. Oh, this is something else Gina sent me. How cute are these? I love them so much. Little um, sticky notes. Oh, one more thing. I found these at Daiso. And um, th there's these right here, these, and these. And these are all, like, they're sheer. And, um, I'll show you what I mean by that. Cause you can still write on them, but look at how cute. Isn't that adorable? So when I found out they were sheer, I went back and bought like 10 more packages of them because I thought they were so cute. So you guys, that's from Daiso. And these are, um, these right here are sheer also. So that's it. You guys, um, it is Friday. I hope you guys have an awesome weekend and Oh, one more thing. Let me just show you really quick. Cause this is how Gina packaged this. And I thought it was so cute. Look at how cute that is. So I got to keep that. That was such a cute idea. Um, so you guys, thanks for watching and I will talk to you later. Have a great weekend. Bye.